We're still at the same cafe, just watching people walk by and we're kind of like cultivating the art of doing nothing, which uh, is something that I'm not very used to. Oh my god. Just relax. I'm getting very stressed very doing nothing. trying to find a place for lunch but apparently every restaurant here is full. It's lunch time and there are many people in Bellagio today. Yeah, I better put on my sunglasses. Oh my god, what's that? Full of life here. So yeah, normally I hate to put on my sunglasses. So I feel that it ruins my powder. It leaves a mark on my nose. But it's so bright today. This is our favorite restaurant in Marseille. Yes, definitely yeah. <coughs> the favorite. Well, yeah. We're back here again. Um, we just had a meal here last night. Yes, it's called Swiss. Ristorante Swiss. Oh, okay. Although upstairs it's not called this, it's it's the same restaurant, but upstairs it's called something else. It's very addictive. Not yeah. Hello. Oh. <laughs> nice right? I think I ate like six of them. It's those. a bit like Italian papadums. Yeah. Okay, so welcome to my room tour. This is the Mi Hotel in Milan. This is the bathroom with Calacatta Viola, as you can see. I think so. Oh, is that? <laughs> doesn't look like it. It's a little bit. Yeah, maybe light, not. Huh? Yeah, okay. Okay, this room doesn't have a bathtub, so I'm going to have a problem. I'm going to struggle with the shower, but, I, but maybe it's you nice. Can, you can sit on the floor. Yeah. Okay, sit on the floor and, here. Uh, okay. Ample space for luggages oh, yes. for one, so we can put yeah. it all here rather than scatter all the place. But I think you can all just scatter right. all the place anyway. Yes. So it's a nice living area with a TV, and all the modern conveniences. It looks out to a park. Okay, he's very happy with this modern conveniences. Modern convenience. I want some food. Yeah, okay, but this is what I want to show you. This is what a modern room should have, all modern rooms. So as you walk in here into the bedroom, you can see we have have the convenience of the touchpad and wow. you can adjust your lights, your climate for your air condition and you can set scenes as well Whoa, which is great okay, so smart it's a smart, smart room yeah smart right. room every room should yes. have this we need to incorporate uh, okay this yeah so we're getting very inspired by like the places that we go for the new home but you know what I always mm. find the Italians do it best Italian okay. furnishing design I like it a lot yeah that's why we are here Someone has started shopping already. So now we are at the Bottega store and Terence wants to buy some t-shirts. He's been very into Bottega lately. I don't know why. I think he likes the towel material shirts. Let's see. He's into green. Copy me. I love green. That's That's mine. I think he's buying some green shirts. He think it's like green. Yeah. Yeah. But it's much much thinner, so it's much Let me see. The price tag is looks nice with the tag. Looks nice with the tag. I like this safari looking face. Very safari, but you need a whole you need shorts. Yeah, you need a shorts. To go for safari. You look very young in it. Oh my god, this is like a fashion show. He's as bright as a bulb. You light up the room. It's a fresh colour. Yeah. The, oh my god, you are 51. Okay. Yeah, but you're hurting my eyes. You don't like this colour? I like it, but it's a tad bright. <laughs> I like the other green. Which one? The Bottega green, like this. Oh, this one. Yeah. Uh, no, not that print. Okay, if you okay, like you it. Like it then I won't get it. Nah, it's okay. If you like yeah. it, just get it. Okay? I don't know, I think it's too uh, seasonal. Yeah, it is seasonal. Yeah. I'm not big on seasonal stuff. That's true. But the t-shirt's okay, I can get seasonal stuff. Yeah, yeah, that's fine. Seasonal. Yeah. We are here for dinner at one of our most anticipated restaurants. Mm, uh, really? Yeah, many people Why? have said that it's very good. This is Langosteria. No. So I will correct you that oh. it's Langosteria but not the original one. This is a ah. distro. But 
tomorrow, we're going to maybe going to the real original Angostura. So oh, they have wow. a few branches, they open a few now, so this is one of the newer ones. So we'll see. Oh, okay, good, thank you. Okay, so this is not the one, this is the bistro Yeah, it's the bistro one, version of it. Yeah, but I mean, I think the food will be just as good. Yeah, it's really good. I could see some fresh seafood here, and there's this outdoor place which looks very quaint and pretty. We're always very early. We try to eat early so because we sleep early or more like we need more time to unload. People tend to eat later in the summer I guess. Yeah, the sky is um, bright till like 10 p.m. Kind of weird having dinner when it's still so bright in it. You figure it out. Yeah. This is the kitchen eating thing I wanted to buy. Yeah, I like this one. It is. I'm just seeing it's so hard to clean inside. Okay, I'm having the whole meal. This one is my favorite. What's that? Finally found it. It's like a bread biscuit thing. Go rate. Yeah, I love this. I'm looking for the butter. Is that butter? Yeah. yeah. I know that. That's cheese. Isn't it over that side? Maybe some scrambled eggs. Is it bacon? Yep, bacon is good. Pancetta. Oh, I really shouldn't be eating too many bacon. Yeah, but bacon here is so good. Oh, yeah. It's crispy and good. Mm, making me fat. I think I have a sausage. Is it fattening? Sausage. Sausage is not good. It's a mixed kind of meat. But take whatever you want. And okay, your brain is up, but I don't think it's very toasted. It's okay, I don't need it very much. Yeah, nicely browned. Look at the size of this yogurt. I thought I was supposed to like scoop a little bit out, but the guy said that I should just take the whole thing. <laughs> okay, I'm big. just comparing it to the size of my face. It's, it's so big. I chose blueberry because blueberry is like one of my favorite. Uh, uh, yes. Oh, it's so watery. Is it even good? Like, is it like your face mask. Put it on your face. Oh, it's really good. It's, it's a watery type. That's why it's so mm. big. Maybe you're supposed to drink it like a smoothie, you know? Very nice. Mm. Very good. Drinking a lot of smoothies. So. so this is my breakfast. Pretty hearty. I'll have a piece of yoga. Okay. I like that. Very nice. You've got to try this. Marshal? Yeah, it's damn good. It looks like kids' bread biscuit. Mm. Yeah. Mm. Really good with... Oh, can you it, imagine it's the very caviar. toasted. Mm. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I love it. Very toasted and crispy. So nice. Mm -hmm. I don't feel so guilty eating this breakfast since I went for a jog this morning. Not a very long run, but it's five kilometers, so it's just just right. And he got a very nice picture at the Duomo yes, without Domo, anybody in there. Run in the morning, I left at 7.30, got a Domo at 8. And you get a Domo all to yourself. Nobody there, except for a few people taking wedding photographs ready, so early in the morning. Maybe I should go there early in the morning. Yeah, you should. Early in the morning is the best time. You must reach there by 8 a.m., that's it. After that, it gets crowded. Wow, um, this is how I put on weight here, okay? Back in Singapore, I don't eat breakfast. Okay, I do, like a cup of oat milk latte and my breakfast. Actually, you know, if the breakfast wasn't so good, wouldn't eat so much. So, mm -hmm. I just wish that the breakfast wasn't so good here. <laughs> the bread is very good. Very well toasted by the Kitchen Aid toaster. Mm. I want to buy that one. Mm, that one is a very good toaster actually. So We've seen all the hotels here. Should I buy Smack? No, you can, but this one is this one has two sides to it. I mean, all the hotels use it here, so... It, it must, must be, be better good. than Smack, right? Yeah. The bagel is so good. Mm. But the one that... Uh, Como is better. Mm. <laughs> They're all good. Italians make very good bacon. Alright guys, we don't really know Milan very well. We're kind of struggling. And the weather is quite hot. God, I look like I'm naked. <laughs> I'm not. We went to Fendi Casa just now, but they were closed. So tomorrow we are going to do some furniture shopping. 
And today I need to buy a new camera because my camera is like acting up on me throughout this trip. I want to go to Leica to buy the new Q2 because mine is like really acting up on me already. I just got this pair of Ortega slippers yesterday. I thought they were going to be comfortable but I've walked like 20 steps and it's already pinching me. Damn! Like thousands of people here expect it. You got a good picture. Quite impossible for me. Maybe later? Yeah, we can come back later. Yeah, anyways, too bright and my camera is not really working. The best thing now is to go into a boutique, sit down, have a coffee and relax. We can go to the Eman Victoria Emanuel, some of the shops there. Okay. I don't know, I see very like strange people staring at me. I have to be very careful with my bags. This place is pretty dangerous. Like, there are many pickpockets around. This is how I hold my bag. Put it right in front of me so that no one can stick their hands in and take anything. The good thing is, these days, right, we don't have to bring our wallet because everywhere accepts Apple Pay. Whoa! Oh. Thousand people here. Yeah, of course. A few million people. But there's no people. And it was so quiet this morning, so nice you at know, 8 a.m. in the morning. I have never actually had a picture taken here. Well, you have to come here at 8 a.m. so nice and quiet. This place is beautiful, man. It's so quiet. Now it's impossible, right? To take a picture. Uh, I mean, it's not the worst that I've seen. Really? How yeah. you can take a picture here? <laughs> yeah? She is taking a picture. Yeah, with 10,000 people as uh, a backdrop. You'll just sure. have to wait. Patience. It's time to go into Louis Vuitton. There's no queue, but I'm sure there's a queue there. I don't know, man. There definitely will be a queue. Just like in Singapore. Everywhere. <laughs> Everything you have to queue for. Maybe I should go in and see if they have the bag. I mean, the, the one that I paid deposit for in Singapore. No, they don't. Yeah. It hasn't I arrived. I haven't got mine yet. Like, seriously. I paid for it like six months ago. I have a good mind to just Ooh, get a refund. You know what? It looks like there may not be a queue like in Singapore. We were furniture shopping and then we came across the Chen Gabbana Casa. Taran seems to like it. <coughs> One room full of Chen I'm going blind. <laughs> I don't know what to look at. Oh my. Let's get take a look. <laughs> We're sitting in a cafe because we're so tired from the heat and the walking. We're sitting in a tourist trap, but no choice. Yeah. No choice. <laughs> Completely food is tourist trap. Uh, Public holiday as well. Most of the places we wanted to go to are closed today. I couldn't buy my camera. It's just a lot of people. So mm. we decided to take a rest and waiting for the sun to be a little bit less scorching. Maybe I can have a picture at the door. We're still at the same cafe, just watching people walk by. And we're kind of like cultivating the art of doing nothing, which uh, is something that I'm not very used to. But uh, it's a public holiday here, and uh, most of the furniture stores that we wanted to go to today, it's not open. So, and just it's relax. quite hot. Oh my god. Just relax. I'm getting very stressed cafe, doing nothing. We've been sitting here for one and a half hours. And I'm getting enjoy. very stressed doing nothing here. Have a gelato or something. I can't, my waistline cannot no longer we afford it. We even have lunch today. Yeah. Besides the pumper hand. But I still feel fat. My clothes are getting a little bit Because you didn't go pasta. exercise, you didn't go run. I went running this morning. You know, for the past, I think more than a month, since I started getting healthy and working out every morning, right? I've really like toned up and um, gotten fit. I have lost inches of my entire body. I'm so happy. I mean, if you look at my temporary house tour vlog, I was looking so fit. Like to today, I no longer feel very fit or very thin or light. So, you know, I think uh, that I really need then to do like, stop to, eating pasta. You, you need to walk. You need to walk a lot in the sun, get some heat heat in your body and perspire a little bit, you lose weight. But my feet is very pain wearing these new Bottega slippers that I bought yesterday. Pain is good. It's very pain. No pain, no oh. gain. You want to lose weight, you need to have some pain. I can't believe I spent like a thousand dollars to get painful feet. Can I, oh yeah, can I refund so it? Can you refund it? online Yeah. We are back 
at Langosteria. Not the one last night, but the fine dining one. It has the same kind of menu, which is really cute. I love it. Not like it is a comic drawing. This place is so much more beautiful than the bistro, well, of course. And, um, the food looks like it's around the same kind of food except that they have caviar and blue lobster but I think they had blue lobster last night as well so I think it's just the finer ones that they add well, It looks like the same menu to me because I had the Fritura Lego Stereo so mostly the same Guys, these are absolutely delicious They are the zucchini flour I'm going to cut it and they stuff it with something Let me try It's fish mm. This stuff is best Absolutely amazing Light as a cloud Tempura butter here is like mm, Second to none So today we are supposed to go and look for some furniture. First we are meeting the guy who's arranging everything for us. We're trying to find the place. The Uber driver seemed to have stopped us like I don't know where. Oh these flowers are so pretty. Oh the drainages. Nice. I'm buying a camera and Terence is checking out the M11 but they don't have stock so he's trying to shoot me. My Leica Q is conking out. I don't know why it's just acting up on me so maybe I will show my camera to the girl. Congratulations! So excited to try this out. Now the irony of this is she's not the one taking the shots for the pink. I don't know why she wants it, but she's not no, even gonna hold it. I will hold it. But she's not taking pretty. the shots. <laughs> so the function is the same as the Q, so yeah. it's kind of like exactly. a no-brainer for me, right? Super and the battery is charged already? Battery probably needs to be charged. Alright, I guess. Okay, oh, I need to set it up. Yes, I need to set it up. Okay. okay. We came in search of puppies. But there are no poppies. I'm dressed in red to match the poppies, but uh, now we see purple and I don't have a purple outfit. Anyways, I'll just make do with what I can find. So this is where the poppies should be, but they're all dead. You could see like some tiny ones, very, very few. Well, I guess the heat just is taking the remnants of the little white flowers. Yes, some white flowers. Oh, that's head. beautiful. I never thought that I would find this like small lavender field in the city. If you guys could only smell how heavenly this is. <sighs> This restaurant called Ratana. Terence says that it's one of the up and coming hot tables in Milan. A very new concept in Milan, but uh, apparently very good food. So I'm here to taste it. Very similar to Sep Team in Paris when they first started. But we'll see. I mean, we'll see whether the food here is as good, but it looks very promising. Champagne cheese! Says that the taste is pure natural, no salt, no sugar, as it is. That's all. We are on this street where there are all these furniture stores, home furnishings. Today we are going to spend a day looking at furniture for our new home. This store looks pretty good. I remember seeing this brand in Singapore some time ago. 
but it could be a little bit too much for the vibe that I'm going for. This looks like what I have at home, doesn't it? Okay, okay. We are looking for outdoor furniture mainly because we've already selected most of the indoor stuff that we need the most of. So uh, yeah, let's go to the outdoor living room. Oh. What is in there? Very good for wardrobe system and doors. Ah, Very good wardrobe system. I like it. And the doors are fantastic. Yeah, we decided to sit down for lunch instead. Our furniture searching was not very good today. So this is a place where they make fresh pasta. Sicilian pasta and we decided to try it. I hope it's good. I'm not going to eat much pasta. I'm just going to share a small one with Terence. I think I will have a small squid salad. That sounds pretty healthy. Ah, I know what I want. Sicilian red shrimp avocado. That sounds good. Can I have that? Sicilian the tata. So I'll have that and I think I'll skip the pasta. Maybe I'll have a salad and then I'll have that. Yes. Let's do that. I need a soda. It's so hot today. An orange soda or something. It's too hot for wine. What would you recommend for starters? You can try in parmigiana. It's an eggplant dish, right? It's a very nice one. Or you can try parmigiana and burrata. Very nice one. Okay, I'll try the parmigiana. One parmigiana. And I will have the red shrimp tartar. Okay. What is this uh, pasta here? There's a pecorino romano cheese and fried pork is inside. What kind of pasta is it? Small pasta? Or? No, it's a long pasta. It's a round one. Oh, round one. Okay, I'll try that. Small one. So I'm actually hungry today during lunch because I did not have bread during breakfast. So yes, I thought I would not be having lunch if I had breakfast. But I guess, yeah, today I'm feeling pretty hungry. Pasta looks good, although it's baby sized. Just nice for me. I'm having a parmesan eggplant and bread corn tata. It's like a pistachio pasta. My first instinct is like, I mean, I myself don't like pistachio. So if I like this dish, it means must be good. I didn't see any way to the fun in. I guess it's not great. Okay, number one, I'm not a big fan of pistachio. So the pistachio taste, I don't like it. So to me, this is not a good pasta for me. You, if you like pistachio, I think it's good. Okay, but my I'm previous one was so much better. I like yeah. pistachio. Let me try it. Tastes like cake. Someone get me a freaking gelato. Please, it's damn hot. You know guys, if you see me putting on my sunnies, it's like really very, very scorching hot. Then I got no choice, I take out my sunnies. Okay, would you prefer scorching hot I... or freezing cold? Oh my god, I don't Which know. One? It's a very tough choice. If you had to choose one, either now or you want to go freezing cold, which one? Which I, one, which, which one I think prefer? now. I think now. Yeah, I cannot I stand so. the freezing cold. cold. Freezing cold is really well, cold. It's a bitter. At least this, you know, like now, when the breeze blow a little bit like now, you see, it feels pretty good. Now we're just trying to find a gelato bar. Get some ice cold sorbet and we're going to feel better. These knee bones are so cute. Watch out for our vlog next and I'll see you in the next video guys. Bye!